For 11 years now, the Macquarie Group Emerging Artists Prize has been supporting emerging Australian artists. I'm joined now by the collection's curatorial consultant, Felicity Fenner, who's going to chat to me about the colour of, of the work, the importance of the prize, mm -hmm. and what we saw this year. Such a great selection of artists this year. It always is. It was so hard to select from the many, many entries that we had, but we've, we did narrow it down to only 10 artists, and it's great that we've been able to acquire uh, so many of those works. What distinguishes the Macquarie Group collection is that it's essentially a philanthropic initiative, very different from a lot of corporate collections around the world, and it, it's so supportive of emerging artists from all around Australia. And also, Macquarie staffers get to enjoy it in any of the offices around the world. Did you notice any themes this year that um, have evolved or um, yeah, stood out? actually. This year I'm seeing quite a lot of work about the climate crisis and environmental degradation. And I think it's, it's interesting because the theme, you know, the land and its psyche, the land and the landscape of the country has always been central to this collection, but not so much from, it's not been really politicised. And I think that's come through, mm -hmm. and it, it's what you expect from, from young artists to sort of take a position on that. And I, th I, think, I think it's fabulous that they're also able to make work of such high calibre mm -hmm. that talks to those issues. We had um, long and complicated discussions with the Art Committee this year again, yeah. Uh, yeah. selecting 10 finalists from an incredible pool of... Always really difficult. <laughs> What's your opinion of how the media has changed over the, over the 10 years of the prize? Well, yeah, I was thinking about that when we were doing the selection. I think of the 10 that we've chose, three are working with ceramics, which we haven't had before. So I think there's been quite a move away in the 11 years we've been running the prize from two-dimensional work, like painting, drawing. Um, there is some painting in, still in the mix, but we had a lot of people um, uh, submitting images that were photo based, there were some videos in the mix um, and certainly in the top 10 I think we've got a lovely range of painting, ceramics and photography. Great. Oh and there's, and there's some textiles in there as well. Excellent. This year our guest judge is Megan Monty, uh, a well-known curator. What's the importance to the finalists of, of knowing that Megan will be judging their works? I think it was great having Megan Monty involved because she's such a well-respected curator and also she's um, independent from here. So mm. it's, you know, she's objective, she's got a great eye and she also in her new role down at the Southern Highlands has a really good understanding of the theme of our collection. The Emerging Artist Prize is important to um, artists, we hope. Um, how is it important to the collection, the Macquarie Group collection? It's really important to the collection. Um, so this will be our 11th year of doing the art prize and from each of those previous 10 prizes we've acquired quite a few works. Um, I think it's important, it raises awareness for us of artists who are out there, just the fact that it's an open call. We get entries from artists we might not have otherwise identified as suitable for the collection and th then once the works are in of course we've got you know, the two or three awards each year it's acquisitive, plus we've often bought from people that might not have made the finals, like they might not be in the top ten, but just seeing their work in that process of selecting, we've, it's piqued our interest, we've gone to the studio, got in touch with them and what works. So in terms of building the collection, it's been invaluable. Thank you Felicity for your insight into this year's exhibition. It's um, our favourite time of the year to support emerging Australian artists. It's been a great experience and really inspiring actually to see the calibre of work this year and I'm very pleased now that it's up that so many people have an opportunity to come and see the exhibition. Mm -hmm.